Do you know how much plastic goes into landfills each year? Did you know that you can use bamboo to build virtually anything you want? Did you know that you can grow food without soil? These are all parts of Ambombay's circular economy. From fully recyclable packaging made of sustainably sourced paper to 600 megawatts of 100% renewable energy, the city of Ambombay has converted to being completely eco-friendly, and that's a small example. Many ideas were debated upon in the designing process. It was very difficult to remove the plastic and concrete used daily and create more space to let nature flourish. Plastic bricks are a result of these debates, becoming one of Mbombe's biggest exports and using recycled materials from other cities to create building materials for walkways and skyscrapers. The transportation and energy systems were also a debated item in the city. The main form of public transportation is the water train, which is moved solely by the canal system and stops at select ports throughout the ring-like sections of the city and is powered by the reservoir. The water in the canal also comes from the reservoir. This reservoir is the center and the highest point of the city, and it is where most of the power and water comes from. The city also included a few water collection towers to gather rainwater and make hydroelectric energy by running the water through a wheel system. Originally, the designers wanted to have many wind turbines off the shores of Mbombe, but the environmental and economic costs far outweighed its usefulness. In addition, we use cutting-edge fusion energy to help power our residents' homes and businesses. Fusion energy requires two elements, deuterium and tritium. Deuterium is found in the ocean, while tritium is rare, but it can be made in a lab. They put lithium on the fusion plant chamber walls, and the protons escaping the plasma bond to lithium, creating tritium, making more fuel for the plasma. The solar energy gathered in the city powers the scooter stations, as well as powering air compressors for the gas tanks needed to power the scooters. The scooter stations work like vending machines. It stores all of the scooters and takes scooters that are out of power. And there are multiple scooter stations throughout the city where people can get scooters. The city's substantial use of bamboo is another thing that sets it apart from others. This fast-growing plant has mostly replaced wood in many areas of manufacturing. During drafting, it was decided very early on that Moso bamboo was going to be a big part of the city due to it being so versatile and fast-growing, producing about one to three yards of bamboo column a day. Before being able to be harvested yearly, bamboo needs to grow out for five years. That's how long it takes to mature. Bamboo takes a big part in the construction of things. Skyscrapers in Abambe are partially made out of bamboo. They are also used as scaffolding. Abambe's residents would use chopsticks made out of bamboo as eating utensils, seeing as there is a lot of bamboo being grown. Bamboo is compostable and chopsticks are easily made with bamboo. Many other products like food, eating utensils, bags, buildings, and clothing can be made out of bamboo. But the main reason bamboo is used so much in Ambombe is because every single part of the bamboo can be used, composted, so no waste is made. Ambombe also utilizes a hydroponic system, eliminating the need for soil by providing a nutrient-charged aqueous solution directly to the roots that keep the plant fed and hydrated. While supplemental lighting solutions mimic sunlight, bamboo and trees cannot be grown hydroponically and take up a lot of space. They are instead strategically placed throughout the city in greenhouses to maximize growth. There are a few large facilities in Ambombe. One is the Omplex. The Omplex is a hospital that is connected to a building for therapeutic counseling so that patients can receive both physical and mental treatment conveniently. Also, healthcare is free, funded by taxes. Fewer large complexes means more space in the city. Surrounding the reservoir, there is a park. This is a free space that is open to the public and is home to lots of wildlife, such as marmots, relatively large ground squirrels, and mountain goats. There's a bamboo fence separating the park and the reservoir. Roof vegetation is also seen a lot throughout the city. This is because in the summer, spring, and fall, houses can get hot and a lot of energy is spent cooling them. Roof vegetation reduces about 30 to 50 percent of energy used for climate control in the summer and 50 to 100 percent in the spring and fall. Also to decrease the energy used for climate control, the city built several housing units and stores in the mountains. Because of the temperature in the mountain, geothermal energy is used to make the baseline temperature of the house 68 degrees, so less energy has to be spent when heating them. One of the main ways Mbombe manages waste is by composting. While there are some things that cannot be composted, our main building block, bamboo, and most food waste can. Packaging in the city is made of a sustainable source, paper made of bamboo, which is recyclable, reusable, and in a fully closed circle where paper waste can be 100% turned back into new paper. The reuse of objects is seen a lot in the city. The sidewalks in Mbombay are made of recycled old concrete that was already in the city, but designers put a thermoplastic coating over it to prevent weathering due to rainfall and air compression scooters that drive over them daily. 
Many plastic and paper milk cartons were thrown away each year. So to circumvent this problem, milk is sold in glass containers. The glass containers can be left in a bin besides people's doors, and it is a designated job for someone to come collect and wash them, after which they can be reused. Bags are made of bamboo lyoso, which is crushed, washed, treated with a chemical that acts in extracting a cotton-like fiber, and a very small percentage of this chemical is used each time, spun into yarn, and processed into textiles. Originally, lyocell was made from wood, but bamboo lyocell seemed to be a better pick since it was already being mass-produced. All the paper in the city is also made of bamboo, and the cookware in the city is fully ceramic and covered in non-toxic coating. Food deliveries are done with boat travel. Aside from the water train, citizens can buy a boat to travel the city. Unlike traditional transportation purchasing, at Abampe, instead of buying one boat, people can buy the rights to a boat and leave it in any of the ports throughout the rings where someone else can use it and they may pick up a different one as well at one of these ports. They may only take out one boat from any of the ports in the city if they only bought the rights to one boat. For education, Mbombe has school days from 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. for every grade above second grade. One of the core classes that kids have every day is ethics so that they're less prone to commit crimes and understand the importance of energy theft. Grades K-12 all go to one big campus that have different sections for kindergarten to 4th grade, 5th grade to 8th grade, and 9th grade to 12th grade, and a separate building for the college. In Ambombe, there are no private colleges. They're all community colleges. Many laws in place in Ambombe are made to protect the environment as well as the welfare of the city. Similar to Philadelphia's 1% law, 5% of the buildings in Ambombe must be public space, private property is excluded, and 25% of public property must be green. To damage or remove green space, on any property, people need a permit from the city, and all electronic devices must use the same charging cable shape, no matter the brand or device. In Abambe, energy theft is punished by four years in prison with no bail and a $500 fine, along with a two-month probation period after the sentence. For smaller crimes, people are given creative punishments instead of just a fine or jail time. For middle-level crimes, jail time and fines are mostly used. For major crimes, people are taken into one of the city's criminal rehabilitation centers. When things are broken, the people can fend for themselves and fix them by themselves. Every type of machine has a similar fix, and extra materials aren't needed for different types of machines or objects. All things considered, Ambambe is a dream city to live in. It's orderly and yet has much variety, as well as liveliness and care for every citizen. It will make your life feel like a dream come true. Packaging in the city is also made of sustainable source paper made of bamboo, which is recyclable, reusable, and a fully closed. I can't talk that fast. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to sneak back downstairs. Good job. Keep going. Get this done. Okay, now we got to learn how to talk backwards. Okay, packaging in the city is made. And also, do you want to clip that to your hand? No. Okay. You <laughs> it feels better if I'm holding something. Um, okay, ready? Three, two, one. Three, two, one. We're never Leo's ready. Outside. Roof vegetation is also. Sorry. <laughs> you can take your time. <laughs> I talk fast when I am doing things like this. I don't know why. I stumbled over multiple words. I apologize. I'm going to get it this time. I'm going to get that. Oh, I'm not going to get that, though. I did it. First try. Is it oxygen? It's oxygen powered. Why wouldn't they use? Wouldn't they use like? Mm. Wouldn't they use? No. I think they no, oxygen makes sense. I just feel like it shouldn't. I thought it was like hydrogen or helium. Jack, Jack wrote something about oxygen, but I don't think it was right. It makes sense for oxygen, though. Yeah. Oxygen tanks is just like the word that people use, but it's not. Yeah. Ready? Oh. I guess we do have taxes. Who doesn't have taxes? Also to the cr <laughs> Check the audio like every two uh, paragraphs. Nice. So don't lose too much, but we're also not taking much. 
Watch this, first try. Oh, my back hurts. That was definitely not English. Like a futuristic milkman. Like, like Kyle told me. Sounds like I'm putting them in concentration camps. <laughs> <laughs> Kyle, yeah, Kyle, Kyle. It was explained in the... <laughs> I just look confused. <laughs> All right, ready? Yep. Oh. Okay. Of course, I unconsciously add words. Okay. Bamboo. Dun 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 dun. Who oh, did it start? Staring contest. Dun 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 dun. Did 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 the door? <laughs> Can I start? Go. These are all parts of. Oh, These are all possible. These are all parts of. Originally, the designers wanted to have many wind turbines off the shores of Ambam. Originally, the designers wanted to have many work. So no waste is made. Should I say, like every day is ethics, so that we can avoid people violating. Energy theft to avoid kids stealing energy. Just to make everybody nicer. I don't know. So that kids understand why it's important to not commit energy theft. 